In this video, I'll explain how you can use the words get to to express opportunity. It's very similar to be able to. And the examples will be in the present tense, the past tense, and in the future tense. She gets to leave school early today is in the present tense and it's very similar to be able to you can use is able to gets to is the same thing as is able to and it's an expression of opportunity she gets to leave school early today and it sounds like a good situation you get to learn English on my website. The get to is the same thing as are able to. Same thing. And again, it means that you have the opportunity to learn English. To make the negative in the present tense, you can use uh, don't or doesn't depending on the subject. So here the subject is they. They don't get to have their own books. It's the same thing as they aren't able to have their own books. These sound like bad situations. The children don't get to have any dessert. Or the children don't get to watch TV tonight or the children don't get to go outside. These sound like negative situations or they don't have the opportunity to do these things. In the past tense, the verb get becomes got. He got to go camping last weekend. He was able to go camping last weekend or he got to go camping last weekend. If you make it negative in the past tense, then you would say he didn't, he didn't get to go camping last weekend, meaning he did not have the opportunity. Perhaps he planned to go camping and he didn't go. So he didn't get to go. In the future, use will and get. This is the contraction, we will. We'll get to see a movie for free on Saturday. This is the same thing as saying we will be able to see a movie for free on Saturday and we will have the opportunity to see a movie for free. To make the negative then you change we will to we won't get. We won't get to see a movie for free on Saturday.